picked up on this video, that means you either getting your CDL, you inquiring about getting your CDL, or you just looking for a new company. Anyway, congratulations. If you know the trucking industry, man, you know the camaraderie is here. I'm glad for anybody that get their CDL. And this video is strictly about if you're trying to search for a new company, how do you do that? How do you search for a new company that's, that's good, that's quality, that's recommended by the people? The first thing I do, man, is just like I go to a restaurant or I'm looking for a restaurant. Let's say Papa Do's for, I like Papa Do's. Let's say Papa Do's, for instance. If, you, if you've never been there, you probably got word of mouth or recommended. But say we never heard of this place before. It's a nice name. So what we're going to do is go to Google. We're going to go under the reviews and we're going to see a consistency of conversation, engagement in the reviews. We're going to see, oh, the food is wonderful. Try this meal. Try that meal. Oh, it's expensive, but it's worth it. So this is what we're looking for. When you go down in the reviews at, on a trucking company, you want to see the consistency and, and conversation. You might see a driver that was pissed off. Why was he pissed off? That should be the question. He said something about his pay. Okay. Next driver. He said something about his pay. Okay. In your mind, you should already be thinking, hey, if I see one more comment and they say something about they pay, I'm straight on them. And that's just how I go. It's simple. I got a couple more for you, though. Transportation. Say that you're interested in a company. How are y'all going to transport me to and from? From and to. Because a lot of us come into trucking and we broke. I came in broke. But I was happy that I had my CDL. You got that golden ticket, man. It's on. So you got some leverage there to kind of negotiate some things. Especially if you got some experience. Hey, I got five, six years. You need to roll a red carpet out for me. Because I'm going to come in and I'm, I'm going to make your company top tier. I'm going to run the truck all the way to the ground. And I'm not saying that literally or figuratively. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to turn these wheels. I'm a go-getter. I'm a runner. And I make no mistakes. That's the leverage. You got confidence in your conversation. If you don't have that much experience, then you got to kind of be, you know, humble and be, be what you, you know, what you got to do and do what you got to do. But if they make you get on a Greyhound and you down there 3,000 miles away, 2,300 miles away, I ain't doing it. I'm not doing it. But if it's a good company and you hear about it and you see the reviews, then give it a try. Another thing, when you get to that yard, the equipment, look at that equipment. Is this 2023? What year are we in? 2023. Okay, cool. Look at the trailer. Is the trailer all beat up? Look at the people, the drivers. How are the drivers interacting with each other? How are, how are they engaging with each other? Is he pulling into the yard pissed? How? What are he looking like? Is he happy? Is he welcoming me, welcoming me in with open arms? Hey, you new? Oh, man, you're going to love it here. Hey, man, come over here. Hey, I got a microwave. I got this. I got that. I got covers. What you need? That's how you know you with a good company. This is how you know. Another thing is, is this company organized? Do they have, all the co do they have copies of everything, all my information? Do they know where to send me? Is the pickups and drop-offs, are they kind of crazy? The vibe. The vibe will tell you everything. Peep the scene. Feel the vibe. Take in the environment. Basking in the audience. That's what they say. Sit there and look and watch. Like a fly on the wall. How people talk in the office. Are they friendly? Are they foreigners? Are they speaking another language? Because a lot of foreigners... They had switched to English. You know, they, they feel it sometimes it's disrespectful to talk another language for a long period of time around somebody who don't understand. So they can't understand. You know, they had speak, they had switched to, to English. They might tell you what they talking about. How's the vibe in there? Seeing trucking, man, I love this trucking. So I'm gonna I'm gonna spit them isms to you so you can go ahead and you gonna you're gonna help yourself. You're gonna help yourself on this. On this game that I'm giving out. And it's for free. So if you like what you saw, man. I need you to subscribe first. I need you to like. When you subscribe, hit that bell. 
comment. If you ain't like this video, tell me, hey, bro, this video was trash. I like that constructive criticism because it critiques me to make it better. And it's another one, man. It's 18 willing, man. Put me in that algorithm. And we out of here.